Wow, ba, you're ready. Send your way to the piano. Wow, ba, one out of row pants. Men perceive the cop one thing. Now go for the case. What's up for one in a row where your pants? Men penisa. What you say? Right. It's wow, no ba. Oh, wow. This is Michael JJ over here, and today it's another day, another, another, another day, guys. So today I'm gonna do something that I so over here on YouTube, you know. Salam alaikum, alaikum salam. If you are from Kenya and you don't know this one, salam alaikum. See your life, alaikum. Yes, see your life, oh. <laughs> so guys. This one over here that I saw right now. I just came from work and I saw something here very important. So check the video over here. See, see the video over here, please. Like, like, like. One hundred and fifty likes. One hundred and fifty likes. Gonna, gonna go there. Like, 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 like. Please don't forget to share. Don't forget to do what. Don't forget to share. This is Michael JJ over here. Ah. Salam alaikum. Alaikum salam. You know what I do? I like that style. I like that style. You know, it gives me. I kept on loving and loving and loving and loving and loving. And then my ribs are painful right now. So, guys, this is my Kogedi. Mm. Let's go, roll it. Let's go, roll it. Check the video. Check the video. Salam alaikum. Wow, ba, you're ready. Send your way to your piano. Wow, ba, one out of row pants. Men perceive the cop one thing. Now go for the case. What's up for one in a row where your pants? Men penis, sir. What you say? Right. It's wow, no, ba. Oh, row pants. No, so for penny. May you what? 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 I ask the amount. Hallelujah, pa. Amen. It's a sad yana make and Leviticus and some sad yaka yano. What's the yano? What's the yano? Why you there? Why you don't win me? No one and after we say no direction, we say we say me you good meaning in area. Me as of penny me could garo. Now what's it? Amen. What you are saying? Sign your man. We say so for me. Now one time you say direction we are. I'm going for say I'm one free now me. I'm one free now me. One free now me. Now when we say we say me free now me. Now me free now me. I'm not saying me free now. You're panting. Yeah, mama me insist and say say we say Obi Kasa say we do the action. I'm not no so for me. Me see you no preaching to come and put your say. Ah, your friends are here. Eh, 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 eh,
Can you change to me? 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 people this is the Martha television and i welcome all of you to our next video lovely people you know what you know what the story i'm about to tell you baffles me a lot it baffles me a lot you know i have these two shocking stories to tell you and trust me you will be amazed how can a pastor shift a church member's private part? Oh yes, you heard me. A member, a church member, a pastor is shaving a church member's private part. Private part. I mean, excuse me to say, her vagina. He, he is shaving. Can you imagine? And another story too is that a lady also crying, begging her fellow lady not to break up with her. I mean lesbians. Oh yes, she has broken heart over a lady. Hmm. You know what? Let me just go straight and tell you about the details. Because I'm, I'm, I'm even confused. Let me just go straight and tell you about the details. Let's start with the pastor. You know, let's start with the pastor's own. But before we start, you know, viewers, this has made me really believe when the Bible said during end time, false prophets will appear hugely. Oh yes, I have now believed it. Hey, my lovely people, this is so serious. We've been hearing news about false prophets, false prophets, false prophets, but this will shock you. This will really shock you. This video you are watching is a pastor shaving the private part of his church member. So, Tom, according to him, I mean, according to the pastor, it will clean their body from filth and sin and it will pave way for them to prosper. Can you imagine? Look at that. And you know what? what, what that's, hmm. You know what's funny? You know what's funny? I've, I never saw any guy or man coming for him to shave them. But only women and ladies. In fact, this world is really coming to an end. This world is really, really coming to an end. And we all have to be very careful of people we call pastors or people we, we, we believe in, calling them man of, men of God. We really have to be careful. How can a pastor shave a private part of a lady or a woman in front of all the congregation at the church? Wow, really? This world is really coming to an end, I tell you. You know what, lovely people? Some people are ins really insulting the, the ladies and the women. They are not insulting the pastor, they are insulting the ladies. Asking them, why would they send, send their body or go walk to the church for the pastor to shave them? why and some people are also saying they don't blame the church members because who knows maybe the pastor has used spiritual powers on them 
for them to believe him you know what you can keep your comment coming at our comment section tell us what you think about this news